You two, what's going on, man? It's your favorite homeboy. Your favorite boy. The one and only. Day one, and we back. It's been a minute, y'all, but we have shoes. We got heat. Oh, that intro, baby. y'all faces again it's been a minute because your boy ain't been on still been buying heat still doing what i do but i have not been bringing it to y'all so that's what i'm here for today look if you're not a member man y'all go ahead and hit that like button that subscribe but most important hit that subscribe button go on and come in at the end of this video like i tell y'all all the time let me know what i can do better let me know what i did great if you don't like it at all keep it to yourself i think we'll get along fine Y'all, here we go. You see the Nike box. Y'all already know I stay opening up everything, so pay this no mind. Y'all open the box. Just do a tape. I thought Nike was doing this for the holiday, but apparently they're doing it, period. Not a good thing, man, because the packages come through the mail. Uh, UPS likes to just leave your packages anywhere if you're not there because they don't feel like coming back. Somebody see a check on this box. Look, let me tell you something, man. The box is just sitting there. If you took my box, I'm very upset you took it, but... No, I can't see why you took it, so... Yeah, Nike just need to stop putting the check on the box. It'll do a whole lot better. And they overdo it. You put the check on each side of the box. And not only that, you go wrap. Just do it tape. All the way around the box. This is the dumbest thing in the world. But, here we go, y'all. All right, let's get out of the box. Bow! Y'all see it, man doing better freestyle okay now this is a celebration of uh nike's 15 year anniversary of the doing Beckham. so basically they reintroduced the 95 air max premium back into the deck man so i mean this shoe came out before and we're getting it again man um uh, a lot of people didn't bite down on this shoe i did i'm not a big 95 fan i tried the shoe on my foot on the right well i always try the right shoe on tried the shoe on it didn't fit too bad but I don't know if I want to keep them because I don't really care for Air Max 95. This is very, very different. You know what? I'm doing so much talking I ain't even got. I ain't even opened the shoe. First of all, man, y'all see the Dorn Beckham name on both sides of the box. You got your Dorn Beckham Freestyle on this side. And it's not on the other side. You got your regular Nike tag. Uh, or the Nike information you get at the bottom like normal. Lid of the box, doing Beckham Freestyle. I love this color, by the way. Um, this is a nine and a half, which is your boy size. This is Nike Air Max 95 Premium DB. Colorway is black, black, and bright crimson. This shoe retails at 170 bucks, depending on your region, wherever you stay. Taxes vary. Let's go ahead and get into it. Oh, I can't. I'm... Okay, y'all. You open the box. I know I seen a sticker or something. Damn. Don't worry about that later, man. Anyway, when you open the box, you see you have this on the lid of the box. I'm going to show that to y'all. Y'all can pause it and read it as such. Y'all see right here we have the freestyle Nike paper. And we get into the shoe. Splack out. I'm going to take one out. Matter of fact, first, I need to pay attention. So, now nah, we good. A freestyle stick. Here you go, people. You're doing Beckham 95 for premium. Okay, like I told y'all, I'm not a huge 95 Air Max, but this shoe is very detailed and it's kind of growing on me. I put it on my foot, it didn't look bad. Um, I think it's the colors, the blue. The detail in, in, in which they actually put into the shoe as far as the toe box. You see the toe box, how it has lines in it? Like it doesn't feel like all the other 95 Air Maxes. It feels like a like a nylon material, a very like washable material. But you wouldn't be throwing them in the washer. But what I'm trying to say is just taking a rag and wiping them off. This is a shoe I don't think you need to crep protect. But if you want this bottom to stay icy like this, you would want to protect this bottom. But... Before we get to the bottom, let's go a little bit more into the shoe. Now, if you notice, they have a netted material on each side of the shoe that outlines the, the um, tongue of the shoe. It's right here on the upper. Um, 
you look like a very netted mesh material right behind it you have hints of that crimson orange i would say they just call it crimson but that's what we're gonna go with you got the db on the tongue or the jb and that stands for your boy justin justin burris the 14 year old who actually designed this shoe very dope hint i love they kept the tongue simple blacked it out in the back you see they put the initials right here that's dope and if you look i'm all over the shoe first of all let me let y'all know that because the shoe is all over the place so i'm all over the place with the shoe now you see the shoe strings they actually made the shoe strings exactly the same color as the shoe lace tips blue as well um it didn't really specify it's so crazy but on the box it didn't even talk about that the shoe had blue and it. it just says black black and crimson so right here on the lower part where you give them the air bubble that mid sole unit you have i don't know if this is like a digitized look i don't know what it is but if y'all see it close up it has this weird pattern that's out, that outlines the bubble and it's also on the upper part of the shoe and fades in the blue towards the front as well uh, right here on the back of the shoe i think it was a dope touch that is actually a heart so one side is the crimson color the other side is blue i'm still not too sure about the pattern of this i have to read more up on it but y'all know i never know anything about these shoes you're goddamn right let's go ahead and snatch this tree up out of here right here on the inside of the shoe you got a little bit of a nike with a nike swoosh there but it states walk to my own beat and it says just be amazing and actually that's a rhythm so i'm guessing that's what this whole shoe is made off of doesn't look like it to me dope concept nonetheless you got the inside black completely with the with the nylon material on the inside easy to keep clean like i said this does not need to be crept protect but i will protect the bottom at the top of the shoe you got your icy blue which we get on every nike shoe already and then it fades into the crimson color and right on the inside of here you have uh, i'm pretty sure well i can't really tell whose signature it is but it may be your kid's signature your boy justin burris that's what i'm assuming so I don't really know. That's what it looks like. You can't really tell unless I just can't read. Nope. Also, y'all see the print right here on the bottom. So nothing real spectacular about the shoe, but it is, man. Oh, I don't know, man. It's going to be kind of hard for your boy to decide what he wants to do with this shoe. Maybe I'll keep it. Maybe I won't. Leave it in my comment. Let me know if you want to cop. I'll hold on to them for you because I don't see me sending them back to Nike, but they will get gone. And something else I noticed, if you notice all the material around the 95, all of this material is actually reflective. So I don't know if it's showing up on camera. I doubt if it is. There's no way to really show you. I don't have a light or anything to beam on it, but I'll cut the light off. But the entire material around the edges are reflective. So that's dope. I think it's dope. But anyway, man, y'all know I don't be having too much to say about these shoes. Y'all go ahead and like, subscribe, comment. Like I said before, uh, we got more heat coming to y'all. Those DB. The DB, what are they? The DB phone posits, the Elijah joints, will be coming in tomorrow, man. And as soon as I get a chance, I will be putting this video, putting that video up as well. So until next time, I see y'all, folks. Ha! We can do it better. We up out of here. Burn.